What is up guys and welcome back to B-Man's World. In today's video, we're going to do something completely different and new and fun and interesting. In today's video, I'm going to teach you guys how to adjust a ribbon on your ribbon rack if you are in the military or just curious about how ribbons work. All right guys, let's jump straight into the video. All right guys, so military ribbons, they have hierarchy, they have different uh, levels. So um, my new ribbon, this black and red one, is going to go here. So first I'm going to have to remove all of these ribbons and then I'm going to show you how I'm going to stack them up on my new rack. So stick around. Bop. So basically you just pull them out one by one. You got to be careful cuz some of them are some of them are tight on the rack, some of them are loose. So take them out. Um, some of them have devices like this one has V for Valor. So that one's going to be a little bit tricky if the backing of it gets caught. So I'm going to slide out um, this one. It's my red service. Disaster relief. So I'll take that out. Put that there. My cap crisis relief ribbon. Then my, my Jaeger award. Take out the Jaeger. Had to be careful with the Jaeger because... Some of them, when they get old, they get a little bit fragile, so you have to be careful with it. And then I'm going to slide over my Squadron Commander's Ribbon. That's my Squadron Commander's Ribbon. And then my levels. So this is my Level 1, which is Membership. Then I'll slide this out. This is my Level 3. And then this is my Level 2 which is leadership. So these two ribbons right here, this purple, purple and white one, and the red one, there's a right side up for them. Um, all my other ribbons thus far, um, it, it doesn't matter if you flip them. Actually this one also as well, my membership. Then uh, this is my commander's commendation award. Pop that out. All right, so because of my new ribbon, um, I'm going to need one more complete row on top. So with that being said, we're going to go right here. This is a four row um, ribbon bar, ribbon rack. Okay. So I'm going to start off with uh, my lowest one now, which is going to be my senior recruiting, senior recruiter ribbon. So let's slide that in there. All right, I'm gonna have to adjust. I'm gonna have to adjust um, this right here because it seems like it's a little bit wide. So I'm gonna shrink them, squeeze them a little bit, and then once I have them a little bit tighter, I'll come right back. So if you like this video so far, make sure you smash that like button. Pop! All right, guys, I am back. So what I'm gonna have to do is take a set of pliers and then squeeze them, just so they're not so um, so wide that the uh, ribbons can't slide through them. So basically, all I'm doing is very gently squeezing that like that. Just a little bit. Just a little bit. Alright guys, I am back. So I've squeezed them a little bit. So let's see if the ribbons can slide on easier. So, focus on that. There you go. So now it slides on much easier. Okay. And what I like to do is I like to look at this end and, and push push the bar through the ribbon. So I'm like pushing this piece inward. So I'll make sure I want to make sure that see let me show you. See I don't like that slot right there. So I want to make sure that the ribbon is completely encased. Encases the um the bar so what that means is this is still too wide that's the issue the issue is this is too wide so I have to I have to bend it there's no other way so I'm bending it like that this way this way when the ribbon slides on smoother see that smoother Okay. Now what you want to do is don't worry too much about 
like any metal coming out like that because you're ultimately going to blend everything together. So now I'm going to add my new ribbon like that. Slide it over. Just like that. Slide that over. And then I'm going to next put my Valor for my Disaster Relief Award. Just like that. Then move on to Red Service Award. So you see when you squeeze them, when you squeeze this bar back here, it's much easier. Right? Uh, then, then comes my, my cap crisis relief, slide that there, then comes squadron commander there, then comes my membership ribbon, which is my level one. That's going to go right up here, but see we're running into the same issue, so I need to squeeze this a little bit up here to allow for the, um, for, for the ribbon to slide through. So, now we're here, slide this, see once you squeeze it. It's much easier. All right. I think I have to slide this one in the middle. Like that. Because I believe uh, my Jaeger is going to go here. All right, guys. So if you like these, these types of videos, please let me know. I would love to keep doing more of them. If this is something that you'd be interested in like military sort of stuff. Actually, on my channel, I, I, I do have a video where I went on an old Navy ship, um, the USS Wisconsin, and um, definitely go check that video out. It's like a live vlog of me inside the ship um, showing you everything inside the ship. Like, there's no video like that that exists on YouTube. So make sure you go um, check that out. It's in, It's one of my older videos, but it is there. It is related to the military. So if that's something that interests you, make sure you go check it out. And leave me some likes on it, some comments. Let me know. Alright, so now I squeeze that a little bit. Voila. Slides right through. And then uh, next is my, my level 3. Also has a name, the Grover, Grover um, Leone Award. Squeeze that just a little bit. Slide that in. Just like that. Remember, you always have to align it. Everything has to be squared off. This all has to be flush. So when you wear it and you attach it to your your shirt, your jacket, whatever, you know, you have to make sure this all flush. Then I'm going to put in my achievement award. It was my achievement award right there. And then finally, my highest award is my commander's accommodation, abbreviated as CC. There you go, guys. That is how to add one new ribbon on your ribbon rack. So if you guys like this video and you want to see more B-Man's content, make sure you subscribe, hit that like button, and let me know what you think. Like military stuff, uniform-related stuff, let me know. Without any further ado, B-Man out. Bop!